Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Colin Veal. Today I am back in Valheim. I'm going to show you a quick build how to make this uh, motor altar. Go over this uh, item display as well as the uh, dragon egg holders. So let's head on over display area and I will uh, get right into it. So in this chest is everything we're going to need for this build. I'm going to start uh, just by grabbing this 12 stone. We'll come back for the rest of it later. We're going to use this 12 stone to craft the uh, pedestals for the dragon egg holder. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab the stuff that we'll need for one of the dragon egg holders first. So we'll go ahead and grab this. We're going to need 84 fine wood. 21 nails, bronze nails, 8 deer uh, trophies, and 1 dragon egg. And grab all of that. And we're going to head over here. Pull up the vertical item stand. We're going to start with that. We're going to make an octagonal shape uh, on top of this pedestal. So one thing we're gonna, I'm going to want to make sure to do is make sure that the out, outer corners of the uh, two uh, vertical item stands match up as closely as I can get. Um, the closer it is, the better it will look, but it doesn't obviously have to be exact. So to do the octagonal shape, I'm going to uh, place one and then do rotate it two clicks. Line up the uh, outside corners, place it, click two more times, rotate two more times, and I'm going to keep doing that all the way around until it should line up fairly well. If you're a little off, it's, as I said, it's not that big of a deal. Alright, so now comes the... Oh, difficult part especially if you have a really high jump skill all right so the next bit I'm gonna grab the I uh, horizontal item stand and here in the middle I'm gonna stack 13 of them so the stacks don't need to be perfect yet perfectly in the middle yet but the top one will need to be as close to the middle as possible I'm just gonna start somewhere here in the middle and start stacking so Let's go one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, so I've got twelve. So as you can see, they kind of rotated or uh, swerved there, but that's fine. It doesn't matter. All that matters is that this last one is as close to the center as I can, and this might take a couple of tries. Um. But we will try that and see how it goes. I'm going to place the dragon egg on that top item stand. And on the vertical item stands, I'm going to place the eight uh, deer trophy. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run around looking at the antlers and how they're going into the dragon egg making sure I like it make sure it looks uh, as even as possible on all sides and I think that actually looks pretty good it's not perfect but I think it's close enough so I'm gonna go ahead and repeat that with the other um, uh, pedestal here once again starting with the uh, vertical item stands and two clicks and making that octagonal shape All right and we are just about done with that All right that looks good Again, not perfect, but pretty close. 
All right, so back to the vertical item stands and 13 of them. So the vertical item stand, or the horizontal item stand rather, it doesn't matter what direction it's shaping or it's pointing uh, as the egg is uh, the same on every side, but I just always out of habit and out of OCD have it pointing forward. So let's go ahead and place 13 of these. Five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and let's see. Um, yeah, I think that looks pretty good. Give that a shot. All right, so ah, whoa, rolled uh, rolled off the edge. All right, my jump skill's too good. Place the uh, dragon egg, and now the deer trophies. Four, five, eight. Hmm. Ah, that's not quite where I want it. A little bit off. As I said, this bit can be a bit touchy sometimes. I think I want it. A little bit further forward and my left. Not much. Try that. And how does that look? Okay, there we go. That got it. As I said, uh, that bit can be a bit touchy, so. It might just take some trial and error. Alright, so now to make the uh, dragon head display, we're going to need a total of six fine wood, eight jute, one bronze nail, and a motor head. Alright, so. This all just depends on where exactly you want display centered. But I want it right about here. So we're going to take the red jute curtain. We're going to line up the edge, the flat edge of the curtain with the edge of that um, stone here. So it's um, lined up there in the center. And then we're going to make another one where the edges of the curtain line up. So there's no gap. All right. And next we're going to take the vertical item stand. I'm going to put it in the middle uh, or in the center, uh, a little bit below the midpoint. Um, basically, it's going to be about two, maybe touch over two meters below the uh, where you put the the top of the red jute curtains. That looks pretty good. And then we can place motor's head there. And so that's a little lower than I like it. So let's go ahead and raise it up a touch. Oh, let's try right about there. I get head back up here. There we go. That's more of where I would like it. All right. So the last thing is the blue torches. We need eight iron and eight gray dwarf eyes for that. And for those, I just had them placed about one meter up from the wall uh, at the edges of these stones uh, right behind um, pedestals with the dragon egg. And there you have it. Uh, we have our altar to motor completed. Well, thank you very much for joining me. I hope you liked what you saw, and I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Take care.